I did. I did. I watched it right before we came here. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, check out K9's YouTube video. He uh, <laughs> or he reacted to his old salt compilations. Oh uh, yeah, dude. It was pretty funny to watch. I would recommend. Yeah, like, some of them were legendary. Like the. <laughs> <laughs> I know exactly. Yeah, the, you know the one I'm talking about. Yeah. <laughs> Anyways, check that out on YouTube. <laughs> it's always good to hear, dude. I, I've been meaning to ask him about that forever. <laughs> now you got your answer. Anyway, so we're finally getting into game one. Doughboy versus Kiraflex, Samus versus Dark Pit. Yeah. I feel like it's it's probably a good idea to go with the Dark Pit first because, like, you have just a, the correct amount of tools to space them out. You have the arrow. You have the orbiters. Oh, no. Oh, but taking a quick 25. I was going to say, look at this. Like, he doesn't have to deal with these projectiles if he's just air camping Doughboy, but... Looks like that's not going to be the case. Runs and tries to get the nail, but he doesn't find it. Mm -hmm. Ooh. Oh, wow. A lot of damage on the shield. That out once again. I thought, like, the second he dropped it, he was just kind of in a bad spot. What are we doing here? We are we are playing uh, we are playing patience. Oh, I like that. Jab into just grab immediate. Orbiters is such a good landing option, in my opinion. Oh, they're broken, though. He won't it's have that at all. He can't rely on it to get back to stage safely. Honestly, it's better if the orbiters break because it has like no lag after it breaks. Yeah. Like you could react immediately. And like the cooldown like of it coming back up is like non-existent. I don't know exactly how long it is, but it's like not even like five seconds, honestly. I'm just so curious why Kira's like trying to camp him back right now. Yeah, just get a little behind, homie. But like you can't really approach Samus. You'll I get fared, you'll I get guess. You'll get like forward tilted, up tilted, nared. Th those hitboxes are insane. And they buffed her. <laughs> yeah, they really buffed Samus. Oh my gosh, that bear killing mid stage very it's early. Incredibly strong. Oh, off stage. Couldn't really do much. Had to recover. Oh, I like that option coming in from Kira. Down tilt to bear. Alright, goes off stage with the electro shot down hit. Mm hmm. Ooh, there's the up B. Out of shield, there's the bear though. I like the aggression Kira has, but he needs to close out the stock now. Alright, Dash Track not gonna be able to do it, but it's very close. Kira Flex is trying to go for this edge guard right now, staying at the ledge. But an aggressive option from Doughboy gets the up airs from ledge. Yeah. Uh, one of the biggest issues about playing Pit is like his kill options are very limited. Granted, he has like a really good forward throw to kill if they're like stuck in the corner, but that's one, they have to be stuck in the corner and hold shield. <laughs> to counteract that, all you have to do is like an aggressive option out of shield, like to preemptively hit him. I and Ooh. an aggressive option there from Kiraflex, Doughboy just not reacting. Maybe he thought he was out of range for it, but Kiraflex able to just run it down. Yeah, actually caught him pressing one too many buttons. Ooh, that gentleman actually sends him in a weird angle. I didn't realize how good that was. Yeah. yeah. Kira, kind of, kind of spacing himself out, but I feel like Samus does his job better. I looks for the dash check, but he's not able to find Kira Flex. Just still playing incredibly patiently, but Doughboy has the lead. Hmm. Couldn't punish that either. Nice job landing on the on that platform. All right, the Nair. Into the back of this could be a big situation. Oh, he caught the gear flex. Oh man, I thought. Oh, and he got him with the charge shot too. Off stage. Doughboy having a very commanding lead against Kira. Oh man, a little, a little too high to get reflected, and that bomb just giving uh, Doughboy just enough space for to for Kira to have to respect them. All right, there's the nair actually. Dropping shield a little too early, getting hit by the last one. All right, backfield for Samus here. He go, he reads the jump with the fair, but the orbiters just keep Kira Flex safe. Side be gonna force Doughboy off stage, but are we gonna see an edge guard from Kira? No, he goes for the ledge jump, but an aggressive option from Doughboy once again nets him an advantage. Mm. Can't really catch Pitt's landings. The orbiters is really good at like protecting himself. Ooh. No, couldn't get the fair. Doughboy playing back, realizes he doesn't need to do much, but there's the fourth throw, that should be it. Oh no, he didn't drop. A scary situation, but the uppie is able to just go back to ledge afterwards, and Doughboy is completely safe. Yeah, Doughboy 
does not really have to approach him at all. Kira still needs to find a way to close out the stock. Nice parry. Oh, that should be a punish. Yeah. Oh, I thought he was going to fall out. Honestly, <laughs> I did too. The second hit didn't connect, but then the re-hit, the third one, I believe, did connect, and that's the only one that actually matters, I guess. Yeah, it'd be like that sometimes. Oh, right, there's this a could be a big opportunity for Kiroflex. Goes out there with a double jump nearby. Doesn't find keeping the near excuse me, near pressure on. Oh, man, looking like Palutena right now. I, I remember when Pit first came out, and everyone was like, oh my god, Pit's near is so good. And then they gave Palutena it but better. Yeah. And granted, Pit's near is it's really, so really good. good. Yeah. It's just that this character doesn't really have much else and is very honest, but the Nair is still like Definitely his best tool. Yeah, and Kiroflex has found so many of them, almost bringing the percent back, still down by about 30%. That shield is looking very small. I think at that at that much, I think he might be able to break it with the side B. Like, if it's half shield. Oh, there we go. There's a Nair. He's off stage. Doughboy needs to, needs to kind of turn off the sauce because if he keeps playing this patient... Kira's oh, gonna come back. No. Yeah, and Doughboy just starting to get a little antsy. Knows that Kiroflex has the momentum, and you know when you're playing against someone as knowable as Kiroflex is, when you have that lead and lose it, like it can get to you mentally. Yeah. It's hard to reset yourself. Ooh. If that was actually fully charged, that might have that one would have put some more damage too. Yeah, but he's starting to recompose just a little bit using these zeros, going back to the camping. He's down by two percent, and we have less than a minute left. Are we going over a timeout? We we out here in Smash 4? Oh, we got 35 seconds. Oh, that's good. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <He's a> nice <laughs> pop. <laughs> we pop off on game 1, boys. <laughs> it's perfect cuz he's like right next to us, bro. Like I know he's so like, laughing at that. I saw the I saw out of the corner of my eye. Like, <laughs> I can't. I can't. <laughs> <laughs> we <laughs> Nexus is encouraging this. Let's go. We pop off ev after every game. <laughs> well, that was great patience coming in for Kira. Ah. Yeah, great patience coming in from Kira. Okay. Oh, it's a regular pick coming out here for Kira Flash now. Really? I feel like Dark Pit would be much better on Kalos. I think he realized that if he wants to play this patient game, he has to have more arrow control so he can get around Doughboy's projectiles better. Yeah, but like the difference between Pit and Dark Pit is the fact that Dark Pit is more of like a the vertical and I mean uh, kills more horizontally and uh, Pit kills vertically. I mean on the elect. Oh, on the side bees, yes. Mm -hmm. um, but we saw Kiroflex get one stock with it. But I think he wants to just be able to play around the arrows more than anything else. Yeah, I guess so. All right, there's a down throw into a fair. Ooh, I like that. Almost caught him with it, too. Yeah, but I feel like we're seeing Doughboy going in a lot more than we were game one. Kind of has his confidence shaken a little bit, maybe. Mm-hmm. I'm pretty sure he's just like, I don't want to play another seven-minute game, bro. Potentially, too, if he wants to win this set. Yeah. Oh, well, that'll be a punish. Oh, missed out on that Nair. And now Doughboy going in with the aggression. Yeah, like, you cannot let Kira land. Nice up B to counteract that. Very fast option, not a shield. It's a really good burst option, too. Oh. oh, and he wheels back with the side B, but it does, like you were saying, kill vertically and on Kalos, that's very difficult to do. Mm -hmm. That's going to hit. That move is extremely fast. The startup on uh, Pit's down smash is, like, ridiculously low. Oh, nearly got the snipe right there. He held it out there. He held it for a minute, too. Nice back throw. Almost hit him with that, uh, with the charge shot. Oh, oh the Fox Smash just catches it without the armor. It doesn't have it all the way through, and even Doughboy looked a little shocked. Yeah, it's like, wow, I, can, I got him with that. It's crazy. Yeah. 
And now, here comes the patience from Kira once again, just throwing out these arrows. The fair actually going to do it. Yeah. And now, uh, dead even game, basically. Ooh, went for a, the saucy reverse nair. All right, detail into the bear, and he keeps the pressure on with the nair. Oh, now uh, Doughboy's in a re really awkward spot where he has to land on top of Kira. Oh, down tilt to bear is such a good confirm. Oh, and these arrows, so much damage, just ex in excess for Kira Flex here. Oh, that was a really scary position. Oh, uh, he's just going to grab him. Maybe he expected Doughboy to jump up in neutral B? Oh, he bounced. Oh, Jesus. He bumped into the wall. That nearly hit him. Oh, nice tech. And we side B immediately. All right, long range grab from Doughboy is going to connect. Mm -hmm. Kira trying to use that to recover. Actually, the side B helping him contest the bomb. But that could be a really interesting bait if uh, Doughboy throws it out there and then tries to counteract it with a, like, uh, Nair, because it has... Uh, that little hop is very punishable. Exactly. All right, we got Doughboys charging up the charge shot, but that's not it. No. <laughs> that that has no knockback at all. Oh, well, he's also only at 37% after Yeah, hit. I'm like, why? What? Uh, <laughs> yeah, I'm like, I saw the percent backwards, low key. Makes sense. Mm-hmm. I Bakira just once again playing with the, these arrows, and like I was saying, the arrow control Ooh, nice is there. making so much of a difference for him. Ooh, down tilt just to counteract that uh, recovery. He hit him with well, the how charge missile. missile. Not kill. <laughs> it, apparently, it has no like. Samus needs buffs, apparently. Yeah, more buffs, please. Help this right. character out more. <laughs> that is death. Gonna do it? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, he exploded he off exploded. the top. Exploded. <laughs> he was so gone. Bomb into Uppy. Nice confirm. <laughs> the Those arrows are racking up damage 2% at a time. Hey man, every percent like winning right there when you kill for it. Mm -hmm. Oh, that was a very risky option. <laughs> okay. He's just keeping it up right now with these nares. Jeez. He's getting the sauce on this man. Okay, Doughboy getting a little bit of damage. He's going to shoot the charge shot, but Kyoflax is nowhere close. Yeah, Pit's pretty floaty. All right. That was very aggressive. Oh, I feel like Doughboy could have forward smashed him, but he dashed away and had to react late. Mm -hmm. All right. I like the air dodge up. Is that it? Wow, yeah. it is. I actually wow. really like the position there for Doughboy, too. But, yeah. like, he got both hits of the Nair 